We are in a state of emergency. Please do not go outside, no matter what. I repeat, do not go outside. There was a third wave that no one could expect, so please just stay inside. We are all at risk. It was about a year ago that it all happened. No one really expected that after the first announcement, but it all finished as quickly as it started. I got lucky, but a lot of people didn't. Everyone was so excited to see loved ones again, they couldn't resist to go out. Lucky for me, I don't have any loved ones, so it wasn't really a problem. It hit fast and it was like an evolved version of what came before it. Like it had learned from its mistakes and grew to be something way more powerful. It didn't take long for everything to collapse and then after that everything was already gone so it was just a waiting game. It's been a while since I've spoken to another human. Even before this, any contact I had wasn't for long. Even still, I've decided to start writing about my days here. I don't know why but I think it's just what I need to stop myself from going insane. My days have been the same ever since the start of this. It's nothing special. You would think a global pandemic would cause something to really change in my lifestyle. But overall it's generally the same. Every morning I'll wake up in my own bed, on my own. Water ran out a while ago and it's been really hard to come by ever since. I always make do with what I have, I mean, it's not like I really need to shower much anymore. Basically. What I'm trying to say is my life hasn't changed to what it should have. I know that says a lot about me, but I was just never a people person. I think the reason I've never been like that is because I've never liked the feeling of eyes being on me. The reason for me talking about this now is because I've been getting that feeling for a while in my house. I used to go outside a lot more often to get supplies and to just sort of generally go outside. But once I started getting this feeling, I just I just hated the idea of going out there anymore. So supplies have been really running thin these past couple of days. It's been getting worse too. At the start it was only a slight feeling of being watched, but now it's so much worse. I can sometimes even hear footsteps outside and lights scratching on the windows. I'm terrified that I might not be as alone as I always thought I have been. I've started to sleep during the day instead. I know that in these times, day and night doesn't really matter to someone like that. Not like someone will be able to intervene anyway, but I just feel safer. At nights I just get to the centre of the house so I can keep an eye on all the windows, because what if they decide to take it further and break in? There's not much I could do. I, I just, I don't know what I'm gonna... Hold on. I think I... Was that just a knock? Hold on, I'll go check that out and update further when I get back.